Hi, first and second grade. I miss you all so much, and I'm so happy that we can still have art class this way, even if it's not in person. We're going to do something a little bit different today. You might remember that before spring break, when we had art class at school, sometimes when you were starting a new project and we were learning about a new artist, you would come into the art room and I would have some artwork up on the board, right? And we would look at it and we would talk about it and you would turn to your neighbor and tell your neighbor what you thought about it, right? So what we're going to do today is we're going to do something similar to that. What you need is a way to write down answers because I'm going to ask you some questions about some artwork and your job is going to be to answer them. So whether you're going to write down your answers and then type them in on Microsoft Teams or in a Dojo message, or whether you're going to type them right into a Dojo message, make sure that before we start, you find a way to do that. So if you need to pause the video and go get someone to help you, you can do that now. We are going to look at this piece of artwork today. My first question, first and second grade, is what do you notice about this artwork? What is your favorite part of this artwork? How does this artwork make you feel? What does this artwork remind you of? And my last question is, what do you think it's about? Why do you think this artist made this piece of artwork? So this painting is by an artist named Micheline Thomas. You might recognize her because at the very beginning of the school year, she was on our back bulletin board with all of our artists. She is famous for painting pictures of women that she admires. When you admire someone, that means that you want to be like them. And this painting, I think, is really cool because it's a painting of Micheline Thomas's mother. And in all of her paintings, she's also well known for putting in all kinds of sparkly stuff and patterns. And that's another reason that I like Micheline Thomas, because I like how bright and colorful her paintings are. If you want to get an extra dojo point for this week, you can draw a picture of someone that you admire, someone that you want to be like. This isn't mandatory, it's not a necessary part of the assignment, but if you want to get extra dojo points after answering the questions I asked at the beginning of the video, you can draw a picture of someone who you want to be like, just like Micheline Thomas paints pictures of women that she wants to be like. All right, first and second grade, thank you for watching, and I really look forward to hearing your answers to the questions. And for those of you that want that extra dojo point, I look forward to seeing your drawings of people that you admire. Bye-bye.